This is what my day looks like. And there we go, look at that. I think they're hungry. Yeah, this is, this is the best one. What is up people? How is it going and welcome back to the vlog. Honestly, wow, my hair, so much better. So much better, right? I was concerned, but you've seen the vlog. Evie did a very, very good job of it and I've, I've been feeling on top of this world literally since my, uh, since my hair has been done. So something exciting that Evie and I launched the other day is our new company, Unique CBD. You've seen us talk a lot about CBD before in videos and on Instagram. Uh, we've been working on a company for the last nine months and uh, we're really, really excited for the future, future things that are going to be happening. But for now, we're really, really focusing on a lot of like the education. A lot of people don't understand what CBD is and the benefits of it and how it can help you. So we, uh, we, we did a YouTube channel which has been out for about four months now, which I've talked about previously. But we recently launched an Instagram page, which I think is looking absolutely on point right now. Look at it. Look at it, it's looking great. So if you wanna learn more about CBD and, and general health and well-being as well, then go and uh, go and follow it. That's also something that we want to do. We want it to be a page for health and wellness and to uh, you know give people the correct information. And uh, we have been actually doing some photos today. This light box, okay, I originally bought this and I didn't really know what I was gonna use it for. I, I sometimes like to impulse buy with gadgets and tech and stuff like that, but it's coming massive, like it's so handy. It is literally the best thing. We've been doing some pictures today of uh, some lemons and some ginger. We have some over here. Where is it? Oh, no, we did, We oh, it's here. Uh, some ground turmeric. We have some honey as well. So we've just been doing shots of this because um, it's a really good detox tea that Evie does every morning. We've got some amazing photos of that. And we've also been uh, doing a lot of different photo shoots with some oils to show you the different uh, you know colors of oils and the consistencies of it because there's a lots of different variations uh, I'm just pumped I'm just super excited it's something that I've been like not being able to talk about for like nine months because with everything and and it's always it's always a normal trend you know that everyone says are oh, they working on something exciting but they can't say what it is um, we kind of didn't want to say anything until we actually had something uh, but this has been a process of like nine months it's been it's been a very long educational process and we've been working incredibly hard on a lot of other things that are still to come but they're not in place yet so I don't want to don't want to talk about it get all your hopes up until everything's sorted um, yeah I don't know what I'm doing today what am I actually doing today I've, I've just done this and that's it what am I doing so I think we might make the pen a bit bigger today hey hello hello puppy hello puppy Hello! Alright, so the puppies are four weeks old now, so it's a nice day as well, so we thought we'd let them outside. But we're going to try them in their dry food now. Oh, puppies! You stay here, man. Puppies! Sure you go me. Yeah. Come on, puppies! Oh, my word! I think they're hungry. Wow. They're hungry pups, aren't they? Yeah. So I think um, we need to maybe weigh them today, James? Yep, we'll do that. Yeah. This one's Mr. Chips. Oh, it's the little boy. Uh, what does he weigh now? He's still... About six... Ninety, right? Six, six ninety. 90. Is, that, is that good? Yeah, that is good. This one is... Red. Oh, that's a little red girl. Seven... Seven ninety, I'd say. They're all fast asleep. Which is good, but so, then they start wriggling. This one is. Oh, that's the big. That's the big anymore. girl. Oh god, about about eight thirty. So this one's be... the one that cries all the time. No, he's lovely. He's purple. Have I done the red one? Yeah. No, you haven't I'm done, pretty the sure I've done the red. Pretty sure I've done the red one. Check. I'm pretty sure. Yes, I you have. So it's the. It's... I need my one. Well, the one I like. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this one's. Yeah, bunny in it, bunny. Well, we don't know yet what we're going to call her. We're after some name suggestions, really, aren't we? Yeah. So she's cute. Eight, eight, ninety, eight, ninety. I'd say oh, yeah. eight, ninety around that. She does feel a lot heavier. Eight, ninety. She does feel a lot heavier. To... Mum, it's gone up to nine hundred. Wait, what, what, what other one have I got to do now? Okay, the big grey one. So she's, that one's. This one. Yeah, the big girl. She will. She she'll fill it. Okay. She's so tubby. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, she is quite she's, like, she's not even like the same size as them. I know. Her little white socks. I like her feet. She's cute, part. isn't she? 
Nine seventy, I'd say. Oh, she's she's more. She's got to be more than the other one. He was, she was only eight seventy, I swear. Oh yeah, yeah okay. Oh, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, 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 you're right. I'm pretty sure she was. So what was she? Nine. Nine seventy. Little piggy. She's playing with the puppies at the moment. They're quite playful at the moment. Yeah, they're just waking up. Do they, me? You got one just behind you. Oh, he's literally done poo right behind me. <laughs> oh dear, James. <laughs> All right, better sort that one out, otherwise. Uh, I remember last it. year though, they used to be a lot more playful when I was in the kitchen with them. Yeah, well, don't forget, they're still very little. I mean, in a few days' time, we'll have to. I mean, I'm surprised Millie's letting me even sit in there at the moment. Yeah, she's good, she's just watching. What you mean? And Lulu. Hello. Hello. It's the antisociable one in the corner. Hello. It's the little orange one, she's so sociable. Oh, Millie. Right, shall I shall go and put their collars on now. Which one are you going to pick? I'm scared Millie's going to bite me. She won't bite you. Of course she won't. Let's see. Let's see it. I think this is my favourite one. I oh, think, is this the one that I like? That's the little girl, yeah. She was number seven, so she was a bit of a miracle. Uh, Lulu, where is it? So she's going to have a white collar round. Is that her neck, what I'm putting it round? Right, you're best to put it under her chin and then you can do the opening. So you don't head. do it too tightly. Lift your head up. Move it in. <laughs> no, don't. <laughs> She's so cute. No, stop. But this is my favourite one. Make sure it's really pressed down. Yeah, this is this is the best one, in my opinion. <laughs> Looks the most like Millie. Hey! Who's that? Mr Chips! Hello. <laughs> I love those little grouse. Oh dear. We have an issue, a serious issue. The freezer has just got to the point now where look, the door, it just, it, it, it doesn't even shut. And you, gave, you guys gave some good suggestions, but well, basically <laughs> this is what it looks like. There's no top rack. So this, it's just like snow. It's just like free snow, you know? Um, and it, it, the door just won't shut properly. So I've got, at some point, I've got to defrost this, either with a hairdryer or like a heat gun or something. Okay, and let's go. I'm gonna be here for a while. This is what my day looks like. And after one messy floor and three really soaking wet towels, uh, it's fixed, look. It's defrost, and I've, I've kind of fixed it so it actually fits. I know this is like this. This is as entertaining as the vlogs get. <laughs> nice way. Oh! 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 I just trod on ice. Oh my god! This is as entertaining as the vlogs get in isolation. A little bit. It was on my heel though. Ow! Freezer one again yesterday because that's what I did to my hand. The plastic cut it because not only do we uh, now have a broken tray at the top, this is now broken. So, um, I'm gonna be having to buy another one. So tonight we have a very delicious... Wait. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what I was gonna say. <laughs> so tonight we have a very delicious dinner. We are cooking, or well, I am cooking, a Prince Harry's chicken pie. Yes, very, very nice. Uh, from the food service HelloFresh, which uh, we love. We've got the cooked chicken here already, which is looking tasty. We've got some potatoes that have already been cooked in here. And right here, I am cooking some onion with some carrots, with some mushrooms. And then we've also got some sweet corn boiling away because uh, that was Evie's suggestion of adding because she loves a bit of sweet corn. I love chicken sweet corn pie. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's why. I, I didn't think, think of it like that. Yeah, because it is, it is basically a pie, isn't it? Yeah, it's got to go in the oven after. Oh yeah, I'm glad we're doing the sweet corn now. That's gonna taste delicious. Ooh. 
And then, and then what we're going to do, we're going to add some creme fraiche and boil it. It's going to, it's going to be tasty. This. Okay, so we've now mixed the creme fraiche into all the vegetables, and now we've got to add the chicken back in. Like so. Boom. Give this a little mix. And then, in a minute, this is going to go in an oven-proof dish. And we're going to put it in the oven for 15 minutes with some potato on top. And there we go. Look at that. That's looking good, right, Evie? Look at it. Oh, beautiful. Oh, my God. That's what they all say. So yummy. Look at that. Deliciousness. I want a rating from you. Mm -hmm. 10 out of 10. Well, I'm going to rate you and I'm going to be... I'm going to be honest. I'm going to just wait for mine to cool off. Mmm. He's done it again. <laughs> He's done it again. That's is it nice. Hot? Is it really boiling? Just blown it. Okay. Oh, that is nice. Oh, wow. That's how you do it right there. That's how you cook dinner. So yesterday, Boris Johnson uh, did a speech about an update on the coronavirus and basically to let everyone know kind of where we are with how threatening the virus is at the moment and if we can uh, sort of loosen up on any of the restrictions. I wanted to openly have a discussion about this, whether you watch the news or not, your thoughts in general, um, because from my understanding, what it was is that it's loosened up a bit in terms of you can go to work if you need to go to work but if you can work at home you can work at home and you can go outside and spend as much time as you want outside but as long as you keep a two meter distance away from people that aren't in your household which you know i obviously think is a good thing that you know people can get exercise and go out and about and stuff but if you've then got a really really nice day which we've we've had you know we've had some lovely days the parks are just going to be absolutely rampacked. So then even if you have a two meter distance between people, even when you're walking down the parks or you're walking down the streets, the roads, you're not going to be two meters apart. Like it's just not going to happen. There's not like a ba automatic boundary around us that we're always going to keep two meters apart. So that, that is one thing um, that I thought about. And also I just think that there's a real like lack of clarity of like what you can actually do and what you can't do. And, and if it's going to be, severe if we continue this or not because surely if everyone is just allowed to go out and about and kind of do whatever they want but with keeping this two meter distance it's just going to increase people getting uh but the virus the r rates in there for yeah so they have an r rate system yeah, they have a they have a rating system which looks like the the, the nando's <laughs> the nando spice rating um but even so there i feel like they weren't very clear because they put their marker like in between yeah, but um means four and three down into the we're hoping to move down into less severe no less severe. yeah and then but by saying oh you can go out and spend as much time as you want outside people are going to have a party so there we are guys thank you so much for watching the vlog if you enjoyed it give it a thumbs up hit that subscribe button so you never miss out on another video and uh, let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and let's keep strong we can do this and just stay inside the most you can and it's it's going to help everyone out in the long run see you later Bye bye